Here's some tips for you to start with. Stop accumulating more sleep debt. Try to make a real effort to get an adequate amount of sleep each night. It's that simple. Start with a bedtime, go to bed when you're tired, and allow your body to wake up on its own without an alarm clock. You'll probably sleep for around 10 hours per night, and as the days pass, the amount of time spent sleeping will start to decrease. If you can't allow yourself to sleep in to earn back some of those lost Z's, go to bed earlier and wake up at your normal time. Go slow and steady. As mentioned, instead of going on a sleep marathon, start catching up slowly by adding an extra hour or two of rest per night. Use naps. A short daytime nap can help restore alertness until you get more rest at night. According to science, the best time to nap is midday, exactly between 11 a.m. and 3 p.m. Your body isn't tired enough to nap earlier, and if you nap after 3, it's hard to fall asleep at night. Overall, napping at the wrong time of day can either put you two steps forward or three steps back. If you're a coffee addict, then you can replace a midday nap with a caffeine nap. To earn back lost sleep, you simply need to follow what your body dictates to be your innate sleep needs. It might take time to adjust to your lifestyle, but after you really wake up in the morning well rested, sharp, and ready for the day, you'll realize that all your hard work and effort has paid off. So, those are the best ways to repay your sleep debt. We finally got a scientific reason to sleep in on Saturday. If you like the video, hit the like button. If you're not subscribed, please do. Make sure you hit the notification bell on there so to get notified every time we come out with a new video. Have an incredible day. I'll talk to you soon.